Intro to Chakras What is energy and why does it affect our chakras? Sunlight is our main source and provider of light, heat, and energy. Not only does sunlight sustain all life on Earth, but also it sustains the Earth itself. It provides plants with the energy for photosynthesis, which in turn sustains the lives of all animals and humans. Sunlight consists of energies in the form of the electromagnetic waves, and part of this electromagnetic energy includes cosmic rays, gamma rays, x-rays, visible light rays, infrarays, microwaves, and short and long waves, also known as radio waves. We utilize many of these energies in our daily lives. However, we seem not to put much emphasis on the visible light rays. We refer to them as the visible light rays because of all the energies mentioned above we can see, visually see light rays. By holding the prism towards the sun, we can break down the visible spectrum of light rays into seven different beams of color. Light consists of seven color energies, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. We can see these seven colors in a rainbow, drop of rain, or dew, and even in a snowflake. Color and light are inseparable. Each color of the visible light rays has a different wavelength and vibrational frequency, which affects us differently. Red has the longest wavelength and the slowest vibrational frequency which we innately recognize as warm and stimulating. While it has the shortest wavelength and the fastest frequency that we recognize as a cool and calming energy. We receive high light and color information through our eyes, which then stimulates the retina and its cells, rods and cones. These impulses would travel through the optic nerve to the visual cortex of the brain via the pituitary, trigger other glands and their hormone secretion to various parts of the body. Many body functions are stimulated or retarded by light and the different colors of light and thus affect our chakra system. Since light and its colors physically affect glands and hormones, they will also have a marked influence on our mood and feeling. Science has proven that certain colors can calm the mind while others stimulate mental activity. We need light energy for nourishing our brain, our emotions, and our physical body as well as our light bodies and especially our chakras. Light can also enter through our skin and our breath. As well, we can receive additional color energy through a balance of various colored foods, herbs, vitamins, aromatherapy, sound, minerals, clothing, decor, and color bathing. Importance of our chakra system. In reality, little is known and understood about the human psyche and its intricate systems. Medical science has proven that toxins and other impurities, which include negative thoughts, chemical enhancements in our food, and other poor environmental factors influence our body. Constant forms of pollution can cause chakra imbalances to manifest, which may eventually affect us on a physical level. Since traditional healthcare systems at this time are unable to naturally or totally alleviate symptoms or cure our problems, this means it is up to each individual to improve their health conditions. We also have to consider that we may be our own best doctor. So understanding the chakra system is more about how you can help improve your own state of health and all levels of your being. The benefit of learning about your own chakra system is for you to understand on a whole, whole meaning body, mind, and spirit in harmony, that when all parts of your body, 
all of your seven chakra centers are communicating equally and working in alliance with each other, you will have little or no energy disorders. For example, if the mental part of you is powerful and so are the physical, emotional and spiritual parts of you equally as strong, it is then that you feel at your optimum level. Nowadays, we live in a fast world and often forget about our whole. We put too much emphasis on independence and very little on interdependence. Our chakras are interdependent on each other for harmony and balance. Your mind alone cannot nurture your whole being, nor can a proper food diet solve all your problems. It is important to understand that all of you has to be understood in order to keep your house in order. The Chakras The Root Chakra Root Chakra healing is important to our daily physical lives, interactions with the Earth's energy and our sense of personal worth, the ability to manifest security and stability for our basic survival needs is affected by the state of our root chakra. The root chakra represents physical energy, vitality, being connected to the earth, material possessions, success in business and manifestations. It is associated with the color of red and is located at the base of the spine or tailbone. It is the energy that grounds us, connects us to the earth, and empowers our self-worth. It is also associated with our sexual energies. Generic name, root or base chakra. Eastern name, Muladhara. Location, at the base of the spine. Color, red. Musical note, C. Crystals and gemstones. Smoky quartz, garnet, alexandrite, ruby, agate, bloodstone, onyx, tiger's eye, rose quartz. Attributes. It is linked to survival instincts, a good self-image, and our ability to ground ourselves in the physical world. Blockage symptoms. Manifests as peronia insecurity, a feeling of being out of touch with gravity, fertility issues, and low libido in either sex. Too open, dishonesty, bullying, hyperactivity, defensiveness, body, physical, glandular connection, gonads, testes in men, ovaries in women. When the root chakra is blocked, we often become spacey, frustrated with our work, and feel physical pain in our feet, knees, legs, hips, and lower back. Sexual drive is often extremely low or non-existent as well, and lack of self-confidence is also commonly associated to a blocked or unhealthy root chakra. The first step to root chakra healing is by understanding if your root chakra is working at its full potential. Symptoms of a blocked root chakra. If you're feeling pain in lower extremities of your body, this is usually a sign of root chakra blockage as it signifies you are not accessing the earth's energy. It can also manifest in health issues surrounding anemia, cancer, heart disease, gynecological problems, and drug addictions. Root Symptoms Concentrating on any one thing or performing mundane tasks such as balancing your checkbook are difficult and are often put off until the last possible moment. Feeling of spaciness or being easily distracted is a sign of not being connected to the Earth's energy. Constant worry and stress over your financial situation or sense of security with home and work is a symptom of root chakra blockage. A feeling of helplessness, unworthiness, 
lack of self-confidence or unhappiness with your physical body are also signs an extreme blockage of your root chakra can lead to depression. It's also linked to the sex drive. So if a woman has a blocked up root chakra, for instance, she might not find sex pleasurable. Or a man whose root chakra is blocked could be impotent. But if their chakras are grounded and free, they will have a good, satisfying sex life. This is just one aspect of the characteristics of the root chakra. Healing the root chakra. Exercise. Enjoy your physical body. Walk, run, dance, do yoga, play sports, stretch. By utilizing our bodies in a physical way, we are allowing the energy to flow through and into us through our root chakra. This does not mean overexerting or exhausting yourself, but partaking in any physical activity helps. It is a way of showing gratitude for our bodies. To ground yourself, visualize the color red, a juicy red apple, a bright red lollipop or cherries. Red is the root chakra color. Focusing on the associated color focuses energy into it. Root chakra healing can occur by imagining the chakra at the base of your spine as a bright red glowing ball of light.